Hi, in today's video I'm going to show you how we can pack your metallic map, your gloss map and your occlusion map into one texture so we can save on a lot of space, optimize our avatar and uh, be cool I guess. Uh, so first you need your textures. I have my metallic texture, I have my ambient occlusion texture and I don't have a glass map uh, so I'm just going to use the ambient occlusion for that for the time being. For this you need um, a little tool that's going to help you make one uh, texture out of up to four but in this case you only use three and for this we're going to be using Fry's texture packer and you get it with Puyomi shader so just get Puyomi shader in your project link in description and you open this tool and you drag your textures into these slots so first I'm going to do my metallics then I'm going to do ambient occlusion and my pseudo gloss map just the occlusion for me again and now you do the technical thing so basically how this works occlusion map only reads the green channel of your texture metallic map only reads the red channel and gloss map only reads the alpha channel and the blue channel is left out for some reason i'm not sure why um, but it is what it is so now we have to figure out on what, which color channel you have your texture data on for me, the metallics in mainly on the green one. So you click and drag from the green one, like this little noodle, into the correct one for metallics, which is the red channel. And now you should see a little result. And for me, I have some data on the red channel too, so I can actually, if I want to, I can combine them. But I don't necessarily need to. So I am going to cancel it by dragging the noodle out. And for my ambient occlusion, I need to use the Gray, green channel so I drag my max to the green because I do black and white so I use max and for the gloss map I do the same thing but I do it for the alpha channel and now it created this texture so I'm going to name it um, texture packing test and I'm gonna save I was gonna work for a couple seconds you can close the tool I'm going to find it, uh, for me it was in my assets folder and I can click and drag the same texture into all three slots and we can test it, let me test the ambient occlusion oh yeah that looks nice that's very nice uh, now metallics that is also what I think it should look like and gloss map is going to be a meme because, uh, you know, I put just ambient occlusion, so it's not going to be nothing sp special, I guess, but, you know, you can see the effect. So this is how you do it. You only use this one texture. Um, you can also change the resolution if you want, lower or higher. And it's going to save you, take, save you a lot of space, not only on PC, uh, if you use this on PC, which you can, uh, but also on um, the Quest, because, you know, 10 megabytes... Without this, you'll probably not be able to use these at all. I think it would just not get into the limit. So yeah, and you can do the same with Madcap Mask that only reads the red channel, as you can see. It only reads the channels that it's noted behind the name. That's what a lot of people will probably get uh, confused at the beginning. But yeah, let me know what you think. Like and subscribe, comment, share this with people you think uh, this will help with. And I'll see you in the next video.